you know, it's interesting, and a lot of talk has surrounded the T-word, triangle offense. We're not going to get too much into that. But, you know, Phil Jackson had so much success with that offense. You ran a pretty up-tempo style there, and maybe it was due to the personnel you had in Phoenix. What are some of your philosophies? What should fans out there, when they watch your team play, say, this is a Jeff Hornacek coach team, this is what he wants to see out of his players? Well, I think uh, as a coach, I always felt you try to do what's best for the guys you have. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I just felt in Phoenix, I had played for Cotton Fitzsimmons, which we were flying up and down, scoring 120 points a game, uh, to Jerry Sloan, who was all about the half court and execution. Uh, so as a player, it didn't matter to me. As a coach, it doesn't matter. And uh, uh, you try to guide to, you know, what works best for your players. In Phoenix, we had, we had some very good guards. And so we kind of, uh, you know, developed something to, to really fit them. Uh, you know, I want to bring some of that here with, uh, with the guys here. But you, know, you also have Carmel, who's a, a, we didn't have any guy that we could throw the ball to in Phoenix and that we knew the other team would have to double team right. and create openings for other players. Well, you have Carmel, and I think Kristaps is going to get to that point pretty quickly, too, uh, with his size. And uh, so there's, there's a lot more options uh, uh, to do things. And, and we're going to find that balance between running you know, aspects, <laughs> aspects of the triangle. You know, and that's why I laugh. And I think that's yeah. why, Phil, we got along so well, because uh, when we did talk about that, uh, Things that I would like to have done, you know, from our offense in Phoenix, can fit right into the, the, the tr you know, the triangle. And as I started talking to him more and more about it, to me it was clear that the triangle is, is nothing but a, a floor spacing. Sure. You know, we did the same thing out of a one-four set in when I played for the Utah Jazz. Uh, uh, it's all on reads. If you pass it to this guy, then you know this happens. If you pass it to that guy, that happens. And it just gives you options that when you get into to big games or crunch times when teams really know what you're trying to do, you have a you have a uh, an option to go to, and so uh, uh, we're gonna you know hopefully blend that some of the things that we were able to do in Phoenix with some of the things of the, the aspects of the triangle and and make a great uh, offense that way and then continue to work on the defense. I thought they were pretty solid last year, uh, and we can even get better. All right, you played alongside some great NBA players. 